Hi guys, DevLauntrexYZ, and we are back with Final Fantasy VII Remake. And last time we left off at the, uh, well, I guess the beginning of Chapter 8 leading into the, uh, the slums. Uh, well, the, the church slums, essentially. Uh, yeah, and also had a battle with Reno. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I just want to start, say sorry for the last session with the, uh, Having to cut it pretty quickly, but that was mainly because of the uh, thunderstorm I was rolling in. Luckily, I don't think there's any natural disasters this time around. I see something here. Huh? Are they trying to stop us? What do they want? Uh, but I see a materia there. I want to get it. We don't have time, Cloud. Uh, maybe we do have time. I don't know. Nowhere to go but up. Yeah, this is so different. <laughs> I mean, originally, Cloud and Aerith were trying to escape out of the church from the Turks. Did not gonna let me go down. Oh no, why? Why? Oh. Through the attic. Maybe we can get out that way. Right. Through that hole. Okay, well. Whoa. Yeah, kind of weird. I'm kind of questioning, are these... Are these spirits evil, or what? Ooh, talisman. Let's hope nothing breaks, right? Come on. Nothing. Up there. No. Hey, no shooting. Oh man. Hey, you okay? Probably. Or maybe not. There's so much as a scratch on her, you're done. Sir! We bring her in, in one piece. What now? Run! Move it, I'll shoot! Oh no, you won't. But sir! So are they gonna shoot her, aren't they? Could drop that. Is it some kind of magic trick? Must drop chandelier. Trying to stop me. Oh, 
Trying to turn here is a little bit awkward. I'm actually taking damage. I hope I still have a lot of health. Maybe? I remember that fight against Reno was kind of it's tough. Like they're guiding us. Stay close. So cool. I can't tell if these spirits are helpful or not. I mean, they really aren't attacking, but at the same time, I don't know what their purpose is. Smelling salts. There. Need to stay ahead of her. Prep for exfil. Or not. <sighs> Just don't look up. They gone? Yeah, I think so. What are they? I think, actually. I don't know. Let's just go. Oh. They're gone. Actually, can I go back and get that materia? <laughs> I mean, since the spirits are gone and everything. Nope, it's not gonna make me double back. Okay. Well, I guess I'll have to come back and get it at another time. Crossing the rooftops? See that pillar over there? There's a station right by it. Shall we mosey on over? Let's. <laughs> oh, crossing the rooftops. Sounds fun. So, what's next for you? A little bit of bodyguard work. <laughs> right. After that, it's back to the Sector 7 slums. You know how to get there? Yep. Of course you do.
That suit from earlier. He was one of Shinra's Turks. What's a Turk want with you? Dunno. Hey, don't Turks keep an eye out for potential soldiers and stuff? They do more than just scout for candidates. Turks get called in to handle all kinds of situations with extreme prejudice. <laughs> Professional bad guys. Gotta love them. Back to my question. So what's he to you? Looked like you knew each other. Maybe he thought I could be the greatest soldier yet. <laughs> That's one way of putting it. Forget it. Hmm? You mad? Careful. Not a lot of room. Gotcha. Thanks. surprised if you had it's honestly kind of exciting well first time and all oh I know what to say first time for everything I'm kind of surprised these rooftops are even still intact for me to, to walk over I don't know of a soldier candidate so petty <laughs> not about ether I'm just so looking for anything good. No one live in these buildings? Nope. No one to get mad if we make noise. That's good. <laughs> kind of depressing, but good. It's kind of rusty. I'll go first. It's pretty old. Be careful. Okay. <laughs> uh. Easy now. You worry too much. I'm not some princess who needs to be coddled. Shit. Maybe. <laughs> Whew. That was unexpected. Thank you, Cloud. Ah, there it is. The wall. You know, I thought about leaving once, but in the end, I couldn't. Too dangerous? Too much. A whole world bursting with life. Maybe more than I can handle, I think, sometimes. Even now. People hate the steel sky, the slums, but I don't. How could I? All that passion, all those dreams, flowing and blending together into something greater. Hmm. Kind of reminds me of... I guess what she actually said back in Crisis Core at she was afraid of the sky, the outside world. But granted, I don't know if they were kind of if this is a callback to that or not, or if they're gonna play along with that idea. This time I'll go first. After all, I can't count on you to wait. Sure about this? See for yourself. Hmm. Maybe I'll go on ahead and leave you all by your lonesome. Just... Uh, Maybe you shouldn't talk. Then you talk. Tell me a story. Story? I'm not good with stories. Not for free. Cheapskate. You're... Uh, 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 uh. 
Go fall. Gotcha. You're killing me here. Here goes nothing. We not kidding. That was somewhat fun. You good? Of course. Maybe? No? Whoa. Green cap right there. <laughs> Never a dull moment with you. That a compliment? Uh, not really. <laughs> Thanks anyway. Eric Gainsborough joins the party. They're getting closer to the station. Even so, we'll probably run into a few monsters on the way. Hmm. Good huh. point. There's a face that screams, so what? Eh, I fought scarier things in my sleep. <laughs> Actually, that is true. <laughs> uh, she's also 17. That's good. I was kind of worried I was going to have to level her up from level 1. <laughs> I mean, that's the thing I don't like about some RPGs where you get new characters like halfway through or even late into the game and they still are at level 1. <laughs> at that point, just it doesn't want to make you want to level them up anymore. <laughs> Which I guess that was always the case for the demon game, uh, the demon gaze games that I played. Let's see, guard stick, arcane wand, conjure a wand, attack spells cast within the ward will automatically be cast twice. Huh. Okay. Contra War one time only during activation. So I guess it allows me to cast spells twice automatically without having to input commands, essentially. I, don't know. I mean, I guess that could somewhat be useful. All right. What does she actually have? I stick with the Mithra Omelette. And... Increase Spirit, Talisman... She's not really... Well, the thing is, Aerith is not really much of a fighter type. She's more of a support type, so maybe just more of a Talisman. Got the prayer materia, use price, light, HP restoration. So, well, I guess in a way it's almost like what? Almost isn't that pretty much cure anyway? So, why exactly would I be needing this? <laughs> All right, I guess I'll go with. Yeah, I'll do that instead. And maybe I'll use cleansing materia, what they call it anyway. Let's switch back to Ifrit. Do a little bit of leveling. Guard stick. Now, why does it take up so much SP? Magic attack, max HP, max 
MP, match defense. Okay. Well, honestly, I guess that's really all I can uh, can do at this point. Uh, I, I guess for right now I just had to just work on the arcane ward and. Well, I guess hope for the best. Possibly. Where do I go now? I don't know. I guess that's kind of my destination, but let's anything out here before I head out. Where are you going, Cloud? Okay, maybe not. I kind of want to go this way. Where are you going, Cloud? Okay, whatever. Look out, Cloud. Go on. Don't overdo it. I'll switch. Aerith is strange. Aerith possesses both powerful offensive and support spells and is effective in multiple roles. Uh, hold on, square to deliver a continuous stream of magic attacks. These combo attacks can target multiple enemies over a wide area. I'll show you what I can do. Get him! Someone looks like they're in their element. Yeah, I'm gonna need to use. I don't know if I'm close to a safe spot, so I need to use an ether. Actually, while I'm at it. Here's another potion. Okay, I guess that's... Well, Prey takes up two. I still don't really... Why would I go with Prey over Cure? Because this... I mean, Cure does the same thing, but... Only costs one of the ATB gauge. Soul Drain. Unleash an attack that absorbs MP. Absorbs additional MP from staggered enemies. Unique ability. As Aerith, you can hold down triangle to focus your magical energies and release it to unleash Tempest, a powerful magic attack. The potency of Tempest depends on how much magical energy Aerith has stored up. Depending on the situation, you may want to store small amounts of energy and release spells in low powered bursts, or bide your time, bide your time and unleash a particularly devastating blast of magic. <laughs> So kind of like a risk versus reward type of thing. The longer you charge, the more powerful the attack will be. Something like that, I guess. That kind of sounds depressing, really. Ten <laughs> percent. Okay. Just keep using it. Ha, ha. 
Nice, that's a copter. I can't believe this is happening. If you would all just please calm down. Hey, what the hell's going on? Come on, there's no need to shout. Popular place. Yeah, well, it's got a good view of the reactor. <laughs> it's on fire! Ain't a show. They know that. Don't worry. Oh, didn't expect to see you here. Huh? Um, yeah. Oh, on your way home from the church? That's right. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Did any debris hit the church? Not debris. No. Trust me. Something at least, but you may not be so lucky next time. <laughs> hey. You know a way to get topside other than the train? Sorry. Can't say I do. Figure as much. Goddamn pain in the ass. So many interesting characters, but too bad I don't have the time to listen to all their stories. All right, what do I have? Catchy's theme. <laughs> okay, well, again, depends how you want to pronounce it. Officially, technically, it's pronounced Catchy, but a lot of people I know always pronounce it as Kate Sith. <laughs> Potato potato. I mean, I'm kind of, kind of odd that we got Kate Sith theme anyway. I think just for all intents and purposes, I'm, I'm just gonna go with Kate Sith, even though I know it's technically catchy. But I kind of find it strange why his theme's here when he's not gonna be in the game, not for a while anyway. That probably won't be until part. Four. <laughs> All right. That was a good 20 second sit. Wait. Oh, now what? Deck is all clear. Rope's good. Go. Pull him up. Hey, it's rude. <laughs> Turk. A real man on a mission. On the hunt, more like. For me? For you? Both, maybe. I don't know. Don't care. Then, let's stick to the back streets? Ah. There will be monsters. Better than Shinra. Okay. People say it's like an explosion of flavor beyond your wildest dreams. There's a Shinra dump site up ahead. Not the kind of place anyone would ever choose to hang around in. But a great place to lay low. All right. 
Got a lot of monsters. Monsters instinctively target weaker prey. Mm. You'd better watch out then, Cloud. <laughs> <laughs> What's with these witty jokes that she keeps telling? Actually, I think before I do anything else, I want to just quickly swap out lightning for ice. So I can have an ice elemental on my sword. And you know what? Thinking about it, I want to try out a little bit of the um, try out Iron Blade. And then I could probably equip the HP up. Yeah, go with that. Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. Oh, Cloud. Get him. That wasn't nice. I got this. Get off. Way actually, <laughs> left, right. Or did they just take me to the same path? Over here. I said there's anything up here. It's like giant cannon shells. Like a giant battle just took place here. That didn't work. Maybe it's broken? Pretty sure this path we're on loops around too, so. I sense a side quest. Go along the path and see if the gate will open from the other side. path to the other side or not? Wonder if 
if we can move this. <laughs> and by we, we me. Is how do I? It's got to be a way to get across, right? Right? I am not really sure. Charge up, charge up. Ow. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, Aerith doesn't have much defense. You know, thinking about it, it's also kind of weird seeing her do magic attacks only. Compared to before, where she would always, uh... Compared to before, where she would always mostly use... Uh, her... You know, the guard stick or whatever type of melee attack. Did I just get? Uh, some effort for sure. Ah, but it's not that great. All right. Oh, I just want to double check if there's anything else before leaving the area. If not. <laughs>
it out. The heart of the slums. <laughs> Still a fair ways off. Well, we did take a detour. Getting tired? Nah. Me, I'm feeling a bit hungry. How about you? Hungry? <laughs> Amazed. You're in for a treat when we make it back. Don't have time for that. You'll want to make time for my mom's cooking. And that's the final word on it. We'll get home quick and eat ourselves stupid. Well, her words, not mine. <laughs> okay. Okay then. The flash. Not bad. What these giant mechs are for? <gasps> it's awake. I wish it kept sleeping. A smogger. <laughs> Oh, so we're not to get poison. Yeah. Okay. Let's get serious. You'll see. I'm waiting. Get him. What the? Ugh. High potion. Give him the cloud, because he needs one too. Uh, go with prey. Thank God. <laughs> One more time. I got plenty of potions to go around. That door that we stuck. Maybe it opens from this side? Yes, it did. Well, I guess that's an easy way to. Uh, but then I, I must be coming back to the spot. Then, if why else would they have this open path? <laughs> Well, I see... Nope, I don't want to deal with that. Take the lead. Here goes. Is that it? Is that it? Is 
Moved us in place, I guess. This gate's broken too, right? Don't think it'll open. What to do? That gate just doesn't want to open, does it? Maybe there's a way to get over it? For you at least. <laughs> okay. So can't tell if she's just joking or what. Getting paid right now, that doesn't seem right. I prefer actual money. Door's locked. Although, technically, I could just slash it with my sword, couldn't I? Giant circle. Uh, that's the station. Here, but... Somewhere else you'd rather be? This place takes getting used to. <sighs> Sector 5 slum, Central District. What are they watching? Hey! I gotta say, this is about as depressing as the Sector 7 slums. The gutted Actually, shell I'm of Mako Reactor 5. For the watch, like As you, you can see, That's there's still a lot of smoke Let's rising from the rubble. While fallen beams and other debris continue to hinder rescue efforts, the fires appear to have been mostly extinguished. Oh, so if we over there! Catch the bombers, uh, that's the director of Shinra's Advanced Weaponry Division, isn't it? Excuse me, ma'am. Would you mind answering a few questions? But we're safe down here, right? Uh, can you give us any updates reactor. on the status of the reactor? No reason for what kind of damage did it suffer in the explosion? So, are, are we the in any danger? Start up again? Uh, Marco Reactor 5 has been temporarily Actually, shut down and all fires have been successfully the extinguished. Like That's the situation is Let's under control and the people together. of our fair city need not worry about any additional complications. We're in the process of conducting a full forensic investigation. But we suspect the device used was similar to that employed in the attack on Mako Reactor 1. Think you'll enlist? The perpetrators of, of that atrocity I'll were filmed making their the escape. These agents of the eco-terrorist group Avalanche are currently believed to be in hiding somewhere in Midgar. 
And uh, given that this group has now attacked two reactors in quick Actually, succession, I was thinking can of volunteering they really stop for the watch, like you. Again? That's wonderful. Let's what take do down you that lens think? Uh, uh, well, uh. <laughs> Have no fear. Shinra will keep Midgar Before safe. Before does break out, think you'll enlist? Of course. Okay, I'll do I'm to protect the city on the All right, let's go. Okay, but just give us an update of our semi-successful attempt at destroying the reactor, I guess. We need to stand up and fight against anyone. Man, oh, what timing? Mind lending me a hand? Place is really hopping, huh? Nice side effect of the train situation. I really so, enjoyed my what do you say? I'd love to, but... We're getting chased. Out every now and then, it's fun. Exactly, they're what give the local cuisine the flavor you can't find anywhere else. Two hundred gil. Hey, my house is this way. The spices and herbs are right here in the swamps. Well, well, what are you doing all the way up there? I was trying to get a look at the reactor. Who's this guy? This is Cloud. He's a mercenary, and currently my bodyguard. That's Oats. See you. <laughs> Oats. What kind of name is that? Two peas in a pod. Uh, Aaron! So, what are you guys up to? We all went to see the reactor. Oh, that's right. You're supposed to come by the house. Uh, what for? I don't know. You're just supposed to. Well, guess we have a new destination. I should probably explain. Uh, the Leaf House is the local orphanage. That's where all these kids live. Hey, Aerith, where'd you go? The church again? Next time, we should all go together. Why, hello, Aerith. As popular as ever, I see. Apparently. But they sure keep me on my toes. <laughs> uh, better than being bedridden. Thanks again for all those herbs. You've helped a lot of people. No problem. Anytime. How'd you manage to find so many anyway? <laughs> oh, I have my ways. And him? He's my bodyguard. Just until I get home. And you're sure he's up to it? Hmm. Maybe. For the right price. Since I'm so generous, I gather medicinal herbs for his patients sometimes. Oh, sense another side quest. Here's the leaf house. There you are. We're back, and we brought Aerith with us. Sorry to make you come out here. Don't be. It's on my way home. Well then, I hope you won't mind me asking for some flowers. No problem. How many? All you can carry. What with all the doom and gloom we've been hearing on the news recently, I thought some flowers might help cheer everyone up. I'm sure they will, and I'd love to help. Let's all wash up before our meal. <laughs> Rambuxious kids. Actually kind of reminds me of, well, I guess kind of reminds me a little bit of Denzel, really. Hey, Do you want one of these? Hello. I hope you grow nice and big. Aerith is a real blessing. All of the children love to spend time with her. <laughs> yeah. All these kids it just remind me of Denzel. Which, uh... Would have been something if he was actually in this game, but I kind of doubt it. Because he's not going to show up... In context of this game, he's not going to show up for at least another two years. <laughs> uh, but... I'm going to have to actually call it right by here, unfortunately. As the time is running a little bit low for me. But uh, at least we kind of started to get an idea of the slums again. <laughs> Actually, I guess when you see one slums, you see them all. <laughs> Alright, so I guess getting sidetracked to getting some flowers for the time being. Uh, but we still had that return out. Alright guys, this is Delphontrex by Z, and until next time.